For an animal life, structural breeding value is calculated as part of the Trans-Tasman Angus cattle evaluation for one of the five structural traits. They'll need to have a structural score taken for that trait included in the analysis. This means that the structural score information will need to meet a number of requirements for inclusion. Some of the key criteria being the animal need to have a 400 or 600 day weight taken either prior to or on the same day as the structural scores are taken. There needs to be variation in the scores for them to be used in the analysis. Scoring all the animals in the group with a 5 doesn't identify any differences in the structural soundness between animals and consequently doesn't provide any useful information for the calculations. And finally, we need to ensure we have management groups of sufficient size, which is about ensuring we try to collect scores on as many animals as possible and avoid only scoring a subset of animals. The best example of this is avoiding scoring only the sale bulls, rather than the entire bull drop. By ensuring we account for these requirements when collecting structural scores, we can ensure we gain valuable information because it's only once we measure it can we improve it. For further information on collecting structural scores, visit the Angus Education Centre. <laughs>